this is Ewan from Phone Dog. We're at the Sony Ericsson stand. I just want to show you this X10 Mini. We're gonna we're gonna go in uh, in depth shortly, but I would just I mean take a look at this, right? Okay, I don't don't need to zoom in too much. I just want this is an Android handset. An Android handset. Look how small that is. It is an absolute joy to use. Not necessarily from a UI viewpoint, but Android in this form factor, absolutely stunning. Absolutely love it. I'm really taken with it. Look how big it is. Look how small. That We're here on the Sony Ericsson stand. We're looking at the X10 Mini handsets, the X10 Mini and the X10 Mini Pro. And we're just going to get a quick walkthrough of the handset here. So can you give us a you know, quick overview of the key features of this phone? Of course. I mean, the basic thing is that it's compact and clever and it should be able to use it with just one hand in any way, whatever you're doing. So what we can see here is uh, what we call the home screen. And as you see here, we have like buttons in the four corners. And that is, of course, because the corners are very easy to reach and find with a, with a thumb when using it. All these four corners are customizable, so you can choose whatever you want to have there. So I will just show you how it works. It's easy. Just click Edit Menu. You got all your applications here. Then when you find it, you just click it, drag it to the corner where you want it, and release. And it's there. In the same home screen, you always have a widgets. If you swipe sideways, you can pass all the widgets that you have. The widgets are really, really easy to add and also rearrange if you want them, take them away. So if you want to take away this one, you just press it and it's deleted. If you want to add, you just have to flick through the one you have, add widgets, and you get a list of all the widgets you have, and then you just press it and it's there. So here we go. Then there's a, one application that we have that we also share with X10, and that is Timescape. And Timescape is a very, very nice way for uh, to, uh, to gather all the communication you have in one place. So this is a widget, and here I have the latest thing that has happened, and that is a Facebook update. Now if I press that one, of course I have been there, sorry, press that one like that, it opens application, and then you can swipe and you will have in a chronological log order all the things that has happened. And here you can see each tile have a Facebook or if it's a message, let's see if I can find a message, you will get a message like an envelope in the corner. What we can do is to sort. So it's, see here also in the corners buttons, I can choose messages. And now I get all the messages. And then if I want to reply on a message, I just click the tile and I go to the message composer and then just write the message. And as you see here, we are using a like more standard 12 key input. In this case, it's actually nine, but more the standard way of doing it. And we use, of course, predictive input with tactile feedback. So now if you're going to write the message, just do it the normal way that you're used to. Hi. How. Or you. And if you want another word, you just cl click on the arrow. It opens up some uh, drop down menu where you can choose the other word. Or if you want to add a word, you just push add. So as you see, everything is very, very neat and easy. For, for both the X10 and also the uh, or X10 Mini and also X10 Mini Pro, we are using the, our new design language that is called human curvature. And as you see here on the back side, it's very smooth and uh, rounded so that it will fit your hand in a perfect way. And as you see, it's a very, very small and com compact device. If we're talking about hardware, of course, there is, since we're talking about, uh, referring to it as both compact but clever, all the things that you want from a phone is in it. There is Wi-Fi, there is GPS, you have a compass. I mean, basically everything that you expect from a phone is in it. If you, if you go to the camera, it's got a five megapixel autofocus camera. You can shoot videos in VGA with 30 frames per second. So all these qualifiers are in, in, the, in the compact format. And just to show you, this, this phone here is X10 Mini Pro. The two phones, they share software everywhere, so it looks just the same. What we have done with the X10 Mini Pro is to add the QWERTY. So still a very, very, very compact format but with a physical QWERTY.
So the only thing that we have changed is to add it some uh, use cases where you, uh, where you have it in a landscape format instead. This one, otherwise, is exactly the same. 5 megapixel camera, Wi-Fi, GPS, and all this.